Court of Life is a unique audiovisual experience inspired by true story. In 80 minutes of music, the listener transforms into a soul of an immigrant who is on a journey of emotional flux trying to find and establish the existence of a new culture. Best described as a work of magical realism with a clear narrative, this is music that draws inspiration from jazz and classical worlds, here presented as a unity aiming only for beauty and expression. Created with honesty and open heart, this is a story dedicated to all the immigrants of this world. I still remember the first time I got inspired to tell this story. It was more than five years ago when I first visited the famous Ellis Island in Lower New York Bay. The stories of immigrants that passed this island inspired me in such a profound way that I began to really deeply study their experiences. During that period, I also discovered a lot of archive material that significantly inspired this work, especially the one that was in any way connected to Slovenian ancestry. The songs, confessions, and also stories. Very soon after uh, that initial spark, I, I began feeling the responsibility to also tell my personal tale, even though my journey as an immigrant was just starting. Uh, however, I did give the name to the project back then, and I named it the Port of Life for a very good reason, because this is what this island actually represented to me. It seemed like an ultimate landing, a pivotal point where a new life could begin, and uh, dreams could either come true. The story begins and ends with two compositions which I like to call my signature pieces, the dusk and the dawn. The first one represents the multiculturalism which immensely inspires my work, and the last one is basically an ode to the landscape of my home and a reflection of singularity. The core and majority of this work represents a 65 minute long acculturation suite in six movements, which takes the listener through an entire psychological journey similar to the one I experienced upon joining a new culture. In the first movement called Farewell, I say goodbye with a memoir dedicated to my parents. Following the phase of euphoria, in which I depict the uncontrolled excitement of a new home, is collapse, a stage in which all my hopes and dreams break down to pieces. In the fourth movement entitled Alienation, I isolate myself from the new surroundings and face the longest period of self-doubt and despair. In the ultimate phase of adjustment, I realize that I have to change in order to adapt. A new beginning is the reflection of that adjustment and is also the final stage in the process of acculturation.
this work really defines me as an artist because it supports my belief that music which tells a real story doesn't really need to be categorized. Because of incredibly long and difficult creative process behind the creation of this work, I consider this by far my most honest and more, most important artistic statement ever created. I, work, I welcome you to experience this journey on one of the upcoming live performances or by getting a copy of the CD which will be released at the end of June. This music is dedicated to all of you.